be cold and insensitive in the face of injustice. In prayer, God keeps calling us, opening our hearts to charity. How good it is for us to pray together. How good it is to encounter one another in this place where we see one another as brothers and sisters, where we realize that we need one another. Today, I want to be one with you. I need your support, your closeness. I would like to invite you to pray together for one another with one another. That way we can keep helping one another to experience the joy of knowing that Jesus is in our midst. And may Jesus help us to solve the many injustices that he knew first. That of not having a home. Are you ready to pray with me? I've started in Spanish, and you continue in English. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Before leaving you, I would like to give you God's blessing. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. And please, don't forget to pray for me. Thank you. privilege of sitting here watching and listening to this with Bishop Robert Barron of Los Angeles and considering the fact that he included non-believers in his remarks earlier today at the Capitol for believers. What lovely remarks these were. Beautiful. And what struck me was when he said, in prayer, we're all equal. In prayer, there's no first class, second class. But it's a very important point. It's not just a piety there. It's in relation to God that we find our equality, because we're not equal any other way. We're not equal in beauty or strength or courage or skill or whatever, but we are equal before God. And that's what he hinted at in his talk before Congress, you know, endowed by their creator with certain inalienable rights, created equal. And so to take God out of the equation, then our equality is in danger. And so it's a very interesting point he's making there that in prayer, in relation to God, we find our, our equality. 
And Kate Snow, you and I have been partners these past few days in just observing this man who just lights up at people. Yeah. 